Hey Simmers, welcome back to the channel. It's your girl Simply Koya if you are new. Thank you so much for choosing my video to watch today. And we are on part three of the Not So Very Challenge. And I have a mentor here working on her robotic skill. As you can see, she's broke as hell and we need to get a promotion. So she's at the Modern Tech Library right now before work, just working on her robotic skills. She's bored because she wants to go skiing. She has a ski lover trait and it, it is winter and she wants to go on a vacation. So initially I was going to have her do camping with her friends. I felt like that'd be a fun idea for them, but maybe I'll have them go on like a little winter ski trip so that she can do some skiing because your girl is really interested in some skiing. So I'll probably, uh, I don't know. It sounds like a good idea. She doesn't have any money. Um, so so I'm not sure if that's actually going to be able to happen. We'll think about that. I'll put that idea on the back burner. Oh my gosh, girl, you're supposed to be doing robotics, not getting high. Okay, scrap this craft and let's start again. Jeez Louise. Yeah, so I think the last part went really well. I'm really loving how her story is going so far. I'm like super focused on her skills. I feel like I have like an interest in like programming and tech and all that stuff anyway. So I feel like it's more interesting and easier for me to focus on her skills. So yeah, I think it's really good. And I also, in the last episode, okay, it's going to work. In the last episode, if you remember, Garrett, her friend called her and said that he had a crush on her. Oh, so Garrett, claims to have a little crush which we kind of already knew but he officially like came out and yeah he's like I really like you like let's go on a date so that's really exciting they have a little bit of romance because of that so I think in this episode I'll also have her and Garrett go on a little date kind of see where that can go and maybe we'll have some easy romance I'm telling you guys I am not opposed because basically every other guy that she met okay well Corey isn't married but I did get a pop-up that he had a baby so he's a little complicated he's got you know he's got some things going on Basil is married Christopher she didn't really like him and he's married also so it's just a typical typical MC command center stuff where like every sim is married even though I turn it down I have it so low and so many sims still get married yeah we're just gonna see how this episode goes I'm really excited and maybe she can get enough money to go skiing but I'm really trying to save up for this robotic station and I also we have to like make sure she can pay rent the mint is about to be living paycheck to paycheck y'all it's like no joke so I think I'm also what I had her do she has a little bit money she ended the episode with seven dollars but what I decided to have her do is make plugins so I think that's going to be a way for her uh oh go to work stop I don't want you to be late stop 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 this library is hella big it's going to take you forever to get out of here yeah so because it's going to take her so long to even like start making good money I think having her make plugins and hack low-key I'm gonna have her have to hack the land grabs and maybe just a little bit of money from them or something you know because she's got the skills but yeah she needs money and I don't really know any other way for her to do it. We might have to come to some devious little skills and, you know, get some cash. <laughs> but it'll be fun. I'm actually really loving this 2.0 version. I just think that it adds such a fun element to the game and I've never played with this career and I like it and I think it's super fun. So girl, you are an hour late to work. Let's go. Oh, and GeekCon is in town. That's fun. I'll have her go to that too. All right, Aminta is home. She is hungry. We got a little bit of money. So I'm just gonna have, oh Lord. Okay, clean this crap out. Rose, clean out spoiled food. And I'll have her serve, like do a serving so that she doesn't have to really worry. But what's, what's affordable? Vegetable and dumplings is too much. We're doing that struggle life. Eat, eat some craft mac and cheese, okay? Or oh, I was gonna say, maybe she can go, they, she can go on her date with um, Garrett tonight. Um, I just know because I didn't get to do fishing in the last episode so I'm gonna have her do some fishing hopefully it's not too cold because it was telling me it's too cold out here for her to do fishing okay good she can go fishing fishing so after she has dinner I'll have her do some fishing and she'll go on her date with Garrett maybe tomorrow and then she'll just give him a call tonight and they can just chat and it can just be chill please okay I have a fire detector I'm like just don't burn the house down you're just making macaroni it's okay it's not that hard yeah I'm really excited for this episode I don't know why I just I'm loving this challenge so much okay I was like girl and she gets tired so early because she wakes up so early Okay, well, Garrett just called asking if we wanted to go on a date. No, we're not going to go on a date to the photo and makeup studio. It's a retail. So I have this lot where I like my sims to go, like, take family portraits. Why would you ask her on a date to go to go here? No, thanks. Sorry. We're not going on a date there. That's hella dumb. That's just really stupid. <laughs> I hate that. Does anyone else have it where your sims just invite you on dates to literally the most random places? I'm like, 
why would you invite me on a date here this makes no sense okay girl hurry up and get your eat on and before i forget let's put this in the fridge because i do not need her food going bad we have no money to waste around here okay maybe she can't use this thing because i have this right here but I need you to wash her dishes instead of standing around looking crazy. And why is the stove still on? Okay, so instead of washing her dishes, she just sat it on the stove. Totally fine. Maybe one day she can get a dishwasher, but we gotta prioritize. I don't know how, she's gonna have to seriously work her butt off, y'all. Like, like, where are you gonna get the money to have a house worth 75,000 bucks? Like, that's, that's a lot. lot. Oh, okay, so this is her friend June, who I literally have not even, I haven't even gotten to show you guys her because she just she never shows up she shows up at the random time like oh what's cooking good looking it smells great in the hallway where are you cooking can i come in and have some no because i'm not home <laughs> sorry i'm always curious just to see just to see what other options are out there <laughs> Hopefully she catches some fish though that we can sell. This just isn't a good spot for her because I've had her fish. Okay. Oh, okay. Spoke too soon. Apparently. Awesome. She caught salmon. Ooh. How much is that worth? 40 bucks. I will take it. Let's check out the collection too. Let's see how many fish she's actually caught in this. Three. Okay. Okay. We're, we're, we are moving along. We are moving along. There are so many collections in this game. I didn't even realize. Okay. Yeah. I spoke too soon. Soon. all right so we've got catch five fish so we are almost done with this first part of the aspiration i'll have her go fishing maybe she will have to go fishing in sulani oh and i wanted to tell you guys so i had this idea since she can't afford to like actually go on a vacation i'm thinking what they'll do is just spend a day in mount komorebi and she can go skiing and hang out because she she just can't afford to go on a vacation like sorry babe in what world like you just don't have the money for it so i'll keep it pinned because I think it'll be nice for her to just once she's able to like hit a point where she has enough money to where she can pay her rent and then she'll take herself on like a little vacation or a little friend's vacation maybe we can do camping that might be a little bit cheaper but we'll do that in the summertime because it's just I don't want them to go camping in the winter that just doesn't even sound like a good time she caught a lump of clay ew definitely selling that so let's just turn multi-select on all right she's really really tired okay she's gonna catch one more thing and then i'm gonna have her go home all right babes go home what uh yeah you like fishing you better <laughs> i know but i know go home okay cool 212 i'm here for it we need that money so that's gonna be her other little side hustle aside from making programming she's gonna sell all the little things that she catches because we need that money honey we need that money honey all right so she's made it home i'm going to have her go to the bathroom take a quick bath and then go to bed oh snap it's winter fest today i didn't even realize well maybe she can spend winter fest with garrett because i am not buying any christmas any like christmas related stuff i'm just not doing it we don't have the money for it so she's just gonna have to unfortunately not check off winter fest because I'm just, I'm not doing it. Yeah, I don't think she can use this sink though. Probably because this right here, I thought it'd be cute there, but I might have to move it because her walking all the way to the bathroom to wash stuff. Kind of stupid. All right, so she wants to talk about her dreams with someone and complain about her love life. Okay, we won't have to complain soon, love, hopefully. <laughs> oh, she's got ashy elbows again. Yeah, this mod is no joke. It's like, yeah, you need to put on lotion every single day or you're going to be not only super ashy, gonna be super super crusty dusty so i guess i'll have her do that and let's see put on deodorant i love the hygiene aspect of it though i think it's super cool oh that's how you put on deodorant you put deodorant on your neck interesting i don't know if she's into fitness but i kind of want to like see if she can work out do sculpting this feel like you know this sitting down engineering life she's not really super active and fishing is not like a super active activity i feel like if i don't have her do a little bit of working out occasionally she is just going to blow up <laughs> and comment down below let me know if you think we should get her a pet maybe we can get her a cat i haven't done a cat in any of my challenges yet but pets sometimes just be so annoying that I, i'm not sure if i want her to have a pet I'm gonna have her make a plug-in. And then later today, I'll have her go on a date with Garrett. I'll just, that'll be her little Winterfest thing because honestly, I'm not really, I'm not interested in doing any of the Winterfest stuff. We did that in the Family Dynamics and there's just really nothing for her to do. She can't buy anything because she's broke and I'm not spending her money on anything she doesn't need to spend her money on, so. 
<sighs> there she goes, smoking in between work sessions. I'm going to have her, oh, not personality, phone, send a message. Let's have her send a thoughtful message to Garrett. Have you been eating all of your meals? Yeah, I have. Thanks. Thanks for the concern. <laughs> and maybe, okay, you know what? It's when we're going to have her and Garrett go on a date. Okay, only $12? Really? Okay. I'm going to have her and Garrett go on a date, but they're going to go on a date in Mount Komorebi. Even though I don't know what they can actually do out there, but we'll, we'll make it work. Um, How do I ask out on a date? I don't do this often. I don't remember how to do it. Screw it. Let's just click on him. And, okay, why does it only say invite to hang out? All right, yeah, they're gonna go on a date to Mount Kamarebi. They'll do some skiing, just some some winter things. Why is it saying this lot is not available? What are you talking about? Okay, I think these are all rentals, so it's not letting me just travel there, so. Oh, I do have a restaurant. Okay, so we'll, we'll just have them go to the bar. There's no point in going to a restaurant because she just ate. So we'll have them go to the bar and then I will get them up to the mountain so she can do some skiing because we know she loves her outdoor activities. Uh, date unsuc- What? 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 Uh, what happened? He was, he didn't even show up. It just said date unsuccessful. Dude, what the hell? What's the actual hell? That makes no sense. Garrett, bro, what's your deal? Okay, we'll try that one more time. I have no idea what just happened. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Oh my goodness. I was like, Garrett, what the hell? <laughs> um, Socialize, both be flirty at the same time. We'll see if we may talk about dreams. She wants to talk about her dreams. So let's go ahead and do that. There we go. Gosh, you have to go through so many menus to find stuff. What's up, Garrett? Why are you looking so sad, boy? We're on a date. Cheer up, boo. Cheer up. She is feeling so good right now. Oh, she's happy because she's near a delightful sim. Now what does she want to talk about? Proposed crazy scheme. Bruh. Oh my gosh. Aminta, what was that? Why would you do that? You know, these sims, they just reckless. They're just out here reckless. Why did you do that? That was not very nice. You're on a date and you're being mean. Tell them about your promotion. Oh, there are just too many options. <laughs> I have the hardest time, like, freaking find apologize yes i just have the hardest time like trying to find things for them to say oh my god and she's doing it again call out for breaking rules what are you talking about aminta stop being an ass bag jeez uh she's being annoying as hell right now i don't know why she's saying that that doesn't even make sense <sighs> Amenta, you are killing the mood. Literally. Why do my sims do this to me? They just want to make things hard. You better not be mean again. If I could find proposed crazy scheme. No! Sit your ass down, Garrett! Fuck! Sit. I don't listen. This is going to be such a shitty little date. Sit and chat and stop being weird. Okay, now he's feeling inspired. She's feeling inspired, but that's not helping. Oh my gosh, Aminta, what is your deal? Why does she keep doing that? I don't even know what that means. Now he has a freaking hurt sentiment. Stop doing that. I literally, what does that even mean? She's about to piss me off. Fucking apologize to him. You're such a jerk. Ew, like, I don't blame him for, like, being freaking pissed off by you because you're being an asshole for no reason. I don't understand that. Just be normal. Stop being freaking weird. This is not going well. I don't know why she keeps doing this. So now I have to, now I gotta watch her because she doesn't even know how to be nice to people. Apologize. Oh my gosh, she's doing it again. Stop! Oh my god, guys, what does that mean? Oh my goodness, dude, he's so freaking hurt by her. Aminta, stop doing that. I can't trust her to do anything. Dude, you're totally ruining this day. This day is not gonna go well because she's such an asshole. I don't even know. I don't even know what to do. I have to keep an eye on her because if she does that one more time, I'm gonna like freaking break her gosh she's pissing me off okay let's maybe okay the bartender's like not even working okay then i was gonna say maybe let's get a drink but i don't i don't trust her okay view a piece of art you're not doing that right now gosh guys i don't know i don't think this is gonna work 
Why do my sins do this to me? Ah, uh, this is making me so freaking mad. And he's unflirty too, so I'm afraid to even flirt with him because that's probably going to go bad. Ugh, I'm too, I'm so scared to like do anything. Like, I can't trust her. Let's see if we can exchange numbers, maybe get their romance back up. Okay. Okay, she found out he's delightful. Such a nice guy, and she's being just like the biggest jerk. Let's see if she can flirt with him and what will happen. Okay, he liked that. That's good. All right, she got... Okay, throughout the conversation, she thought that he was into her. That's good. Blow him a kiss. And let's see if she can just like not... Oh, I'm so scared. Let's have them have their first kiss. Let's try to recover some of the damage. And hopefully he's not too turned off by her. They're so cute. They could be cute as long as she doesn't freaking do that shit again. I like keep an eye on her interactions. Oh my gosh, guys, like my heart. <laughs> my heart. <laughs> I really want them to go skiing. It's gonna be an okay day. She doesn't seem to want to do anything else. Where's the bathroom though? There's nothing to do with this bar. This bar's super lame. Oh, he's being sweet to her. I love it. Okay, she's finally stopped with the weird, bad, breaking the rules thing i don't know what that is i'm sure it's a part of slice of life but it's actually infuriating who are you miss judgy okay i'm fine with that okay i thought i banned push-ups through mc command center like dude this is unnecessary just stop it uh -huh, that's so cute all right i'll let them slow dance but she has to pee i'm gonna need her to which one is okay it's unisex go to the bathroom it'll be an okay date so it is what it is i'm not really tripping too much but it's helping their romance by them slow dancing which i love oh but i feel like he's still he's still just like uh i think i like her but she's a little judgmental I'm just trying to see if there's anything else they can do no one's at the little stand so after this after their date, I'll probably just have her go skiing by herself just to have her do that because that's something that she's kind of into. But she's feeling good about her first kiss. She's happy. She loves chatting. Not the best first kiss, obviously, but that's totally fine. And let's just kind of have them continue this romance. I do want to see what his thoughts about having a baby are, though. As you know, we need them babies. Oh, I love it. Okay, I like the autonomous. Uh-oh. What is he saying to her now? Okay, now he's yelling. Oh, these two are on some shit. They are on like a whole other level. I don't know what their deal is. One minute they're like into each other. The next minute they're yelling at each other. It's like, what? What even is happening? Okay, now they're discussing having a baby. Okay. Yes, yes, a thousand times. Yes, I want to see our love create a beautiful child. Oh okay they're such weirdos they this is i'm getting like toxic toxic relationship energy oh my goodness they they are all over the place y'all they are all over the place Ugh, i can't okay let's have her go skiing and that went um interestingly <laughs> All right, we'll bring Camilla. We'll bring Camilla and go skiing and end the day with a little girl's time since she has the day off anyway. She might as well enjoy it outdoors since that's like her vibe. And yeah, it'll be fun. I haven't done like skiing or anything in this game in a very long time. All right, okay, girl, you over here in not in the right outfit for this. Ooh, it is like really snowing up here in the mountains. Where is the skiing area? Oh my gosh, I can't see anything. I haven't come here with this reshade. Holy crap, you can't really see much. All right, why don't you, you know what? I'm gonna break, break the rules a little bit and get her her own set of skis so that she, this is her thing. I want her and Garrett to just like autonomously woohoo and kind of see what happens. See if she like has an oopsie baby. Okay, she has 19 days till she ages up into an adult. So we have plenty of time, but if we can have a little baby early, I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna be happy about that. <laughs> all right no we don't want to buy a snowboard here we go wait those are that's for kids ah they're purple i wish you could choose what color but you know what it's fine i don't even know why i brought what's her name what's the point we're probably not even let's go no i don't want to go snowboarding i want to go skiing go skiing continuously together okay yeah let's do that yeah it's like snowing super hard out here yay we got money on our day off so just made back the money that we spent on skis i was not supposed to be spending her money <laughs> but i can't help it she really wants to do this this is her this is her one trait that like she's really like really loves skiing and outdoors so oh she's hungry whoops all right let's see how good is she at this ah i love it <laughs> 
<laughs> That's so funny. Oh, crap. Oh, not great, but it's okay. I don't know if um, Camille is going to come or not, but yeah, that date, guys, <laughs> that date was wild. I, I don't know. Um, <laughs> they're like a little, they're like into each other, but they're kind of petty and toxic. It's so weird. I don't know why they were interacting like that, but let me know what you thought of the date. Do you think we should still keep trying to see where things go with Garrett or see if maybe we can find another single sim in the game? I don't know. I want to, I don't know. We'll just kind of see what happens, but they definitely have like weird, toxic, but into each other energy. I don't know. It's so funny though. <laughs> so let me know what you guys thought of this episode and the date and I will catch you guys in the next one. I'm super excited. Still loving this challenge. So thank you guys again for all the support and I will see you guys in the next video video. Bye.